Rockefeller Center is a popular business, television, and visitor center. It is without question the most popular Christmas holiday site in New York City. The tree that is installed here is the most viewed in all of Christendom. The plaza in front of Building 30 Rockefeller hosted for seven weeks the creation of artist Thomas Hausago. It's called Masks and was designed specifically for this plaza where the Christmas tree is installed every year. Five masks standing vertically ranging in height from 14 and a half to 60 and a half feet and forming a pentagonal space. They are standing on a step base of redwood beams and were casted in clay in industrial strength plaster. It is a work to be looked at and stepped in. This duo dynamic of appreciation provided for two very unique experiences that help in the process of balancing opposites within ourselves. From outside and walking around it, we are able to appreciate five distinct yet connected sides. Each of the masks reflects a different visual vocabulary for the human face. There is the abstracted, the linear, the flattened and layered, and the substantial with what appears to be pockets of extra material. On deeper examination, we discern other symbols that embody interesting and profound ideas. On this mask, on the eyes section, we are able to discern the symbol of infinity, the number eight lying to the side. This symbol is complex and beautiful in its simplicity and fluidity. It embodies the notion of eternal balance and other qualities that are multidimensional in nature and supportive of humanity's anchoring on a more ennobled platform. The base of the work is made of redwood beams. Redwoods are the tallest living beings on earth and can live for up to 2,000 years and reach heights of up to 360 feet. Like Christmas trees, they keep their green needle leaves year-round. Their dense bark provides protection against the periodic fires that sweep through redwood forests. In this redwood essence, we can feel qualities of verticality and reaching upward. This leads us to experience its tremendous physical vitality, massive and rapid growth, and its defiance of gravity. In their ability to lift water to their crowns, they not only support existence for themselves, but also for that of many other creatures that inhabit their diverse vertical ecosystems. Redwood is the embodiment of life in the form of a tree. Stepping up to the interior of the work, the aesthetic experience is deepened. You see a grid-like armature of raybar inlaid with hemp and plaster. Peering through the openings of the masks, we see people passing by. People around the work and the surrounding architecture. Each side is different. This pentagonal room evokes feelings of being in a space for the purpose of rituals that are mysterious and distant. Feels like you are on the inside of a head, perceiving the reality around you through the available windows. To understand this integrative element in this work, we must look at the dynamic of this pentagonal space. As a five-sided figure, the pentagon is balanced and versatile. Its rich symbolism is cross-cultural and far-reaching. One of the most popular buildings in the world and located in Washington, D.C. is the Pentagon. The building is functional for its operations and its shape is associated with strong protective qualities. Public works of art are unique and carry strong messages that in turn mold the cultural character of the population that activate them. As global citizens, we are finding, in works of art from artists like Thomas Hausago, the glue that will hold our global collective exchange in one piece. The imagery that defines this and other centers of New York City is of a powerful international nature. The messages they communicate transcend time and physical perception. 
Thank you for your attention. For more videos, please visit 5dguide.com.